everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you have seen my previous videos, if not, welcome. My name is Shauna. I am a New York City based model and visual artist and I absolutely love colorful makeup. Today I'm going to be doing a look to go with another one of my Christopher John Rogers X Target collab and I was trying to figure out how to do something different because a lot of the colors are the same across these looks just put together in different ways. So I came up with something that is going to use some of the colors I've been using lately, but I'm going to do something that's kind of middle of the ground as far as level of drama. And so I am pulling colors from several different places because I don't have a single palette that has everything that I want to use in it. So I pulled out my Colored Rain Juicy Boost palette. I haven't used this in a while. I do really love this palette. And I'm thinking that these three here along the bottom are going to be nice to start with to pull in the crease and pull down into the outer V. And then I'm also going to be going in with the Annette's Makeup Corner X Menagerie collab, the Serenity palette. And I know that I'm for sure going to be using this orange. I may use this yellow and perhaps this blue. Um, but most likely, um, probably just the orange and maybe the yellow. Then I also am going to be using the Double Down Cosmetics Future Collection in collaboration with Media J. A lot of collabs going on. Um, I know that I'm going to be using the um, Unity, I think that's the name. Wait, no, no, no. What is it? The Belief? I think it's The Belief. Hold on. Sometimes it's hard. No, the strength, the strength. Okay, there we go. Sorry. <laughs> Sometimes it's hard to remember all the names. Um, so that's the strength. And then this one is the belief. Right, right, right. Okay, so I may be using those two as well. And then on the cheeks, I'm going to go in with my Fenty bronzer as usual. And then I'm going to use the Dimension blush and the Fortune highlighter from Double Down. And then I finally um, bought some Prop of Beauty lipsticks. I've been wanting to try them for a while. They are black owned, as are actually, um, it, it's a predominantly black owned tutorial um, because Double Down is as well and Colored Rain. So Prop of Beauty makes colors that are going to show up more on deeper complexions, but they will of course work for everybody. And so this color is Moxie. It's a beautiful mid-tone neutral color and it has a little bit of a red in it. It's, it's really pretty. I think it will go nicely with the dress I'm going to wear. Alright, so enough talking. <laughs> Let's just get into the look. First I'm going in with the color Ginger Bay from the Colored Rain Juicy Boost palette and this is a fairly light matte yellow and I'm placing this in the inner section of the crease and taking it a little bit above and I'm taking this color about halfway in. shade turmeric shot which is a matte orange and I'm taking this from about the midway point a little bit closer in and I'm taking this outward and this is just to deepen that up. dimension I'm going in with the shade orange carrot which is a matte orange and I'm taking this in the outer V and pulling it in a little about the midway point of the crease Now to 
begin the work on the lid, I am taking the shade Monarch, which is a shimmery orange from the Serenity palette from Annette's Makeup Corner, X Menagerie. And now on the inner part of the lid, I'm taking the shade The Belief, which is a shimmery blue from Double Down Cosmetics' X Media J The Future Collection, and I'm just blending that. And now under the eye, I am taking the shade The Belief, which is a light shimmery green shade from that same Double Down X Media J Collection. And now for the inner eye highlight color, I am taking the shade Sunbeam from the Serenity palette, and this is a golden metallic yellow color. And now, as usual, I am curling my lashes, and then I'm going in with the Pacifica Beauty Vegan Collagen Mascara. I'm going in with my Fenty Beauty Sunstalker Bronzer in the shade Shady Biz, and I am placing this all over the cheeks, the forehead, around the jawline, and around the nose for a subtle contour. And now for blush, I'm going in with Double Down Cosmetics The Dimension, which is a peachy, shimmery shade. It is a beautiful summery blush, and I need to use this more than I do. And now for highlighter, I am going in with the Double Down Cosmetics The Fortune Highlighter from the Ancestral Collection Volume 1. Off the look, I'm going in with Propa Beauty's lipstick in the shade Moxie, which is a nice neutral shade, and I would say it's a mid tone, but on me it's a little darker. And it's really, really a beautiful neutral shade that's going to go with a lot of different looks. It came out pretty much the way that I thought that it would. The lid is a little different, but I'm not unhappy with it at all. I'm, I'm pretty happy with it. So I don't really have a review other than the lipstick. The lipstick is the only new product that I use, and I really like it. The formula is very creamy. It's very pigmented. You have one swipe, and it's fully opaque. Um, and I will see how it wears, though I'm not going to really have much... Um, test for that because after I take my photos I'm gonna have to put a mask on so I can go see my friend um, but I, I think I'm gonna really like this formula and yeah um, since the eyeshadows are all ones that I've used before I love them I think that everything goes well together um, yeah, I don't really have much else to say about that. I think that I did achieve what I wanted as far as doing something with colors I've been using lately, but using them in a different way. And I'm excited to see how it's going to look with the CGR X Target dress. So stay tuned for a few more seconds to see that look. And leave me a comment down below about what your favorite part is, uh, what some looks are that you would like to see. I definitely have so many palettes that I need to use again and would like to get more use out of and I would definitely like to do more tutorials like this where I just pull from several different palettes rather than feeling like I have to be stuck with well not stuck but but focused on just one so yeah and if you like this kind of content then make sure you're subscribed and hit that notification bell 
And until next time, stay safe and stay well. Bye.